now that we know reptiles are covered in scales, let's focus on amphibians and how their skin is different than a reptile. Amphibians can have smooth and wet or dry and bumpy skin. The most common amphibians in Iowa are frogs and toads. But did you know there are also salamanders in Iowa? They're very sneaky. Let's focus on frogs and toads and how we can tell the difference. You may have seen an American toad in your backyard before, but how do we know if it's a toad? Toads have darker, bumpier skin than frogs and are typically not as slimy. Frogs, like the eastern gray tree frog, are very common in backyards too. They can change color and it can range from gray to green. Frogs are smoother than a toad and some even have the ability to stick to vertical surfaces like windows. There are lots of different kinds of frogs in Iowa. You are more likely to find frogs near water and toads under decaying leaves or in flower beds. You can also listen to the calls of different frogs and toads to observe who is in your neighborhood. Anytime you can observe an amphibian in the wild is a good sign. As amphibians, they are important indicators to the health of the environment. They can absorb pollution in their environment through their skin, so they prefer to live in healthy habitats. The name amphibian means two lives, as these critters start their lives off in the water. A good way to look for signs of amphibians in the water are for their eggs. You can also look for different stages of their life cycle, like tadpoles. 